Um, greetings to my For the Love podcast community. So right now we are in a series about transitions. It's just, just what the team and I really felt was salient right now that virtually all of us are in some kind of transition right now. Some of the transitions we are choosing, we're choosing to make a change. We are choosing to move from this space to this one, from this relationship to another, from this paradigm to a different one. And then the truth is some of the transitions are choosing us. It's not something we signed up for. It's not something we expected or planned for or wanted. And yet here we are, right? And so I just wanted to tell you a little bit my personal takeaway from my recording with Amy Downs. Amy is a really incredible woman and I loved my conversation with her. So Amy is a survivor of the Oklahoma City bombing. She was just 28 when that happened. And first of all, you guys will see this during this episode. She is a captivating storyteller. Like she was walking through her experience minute by minute. The day she was on the third floor of the Murrow building, the third floor and what she heard, what she smelled, what she saw, what she felt, what it was like 10 feet under the rubble for all those hours. I was like leaning forward like this in my chair, just hanging on her every word. Um, I just felt like I was back there. I mean, I remember, of course I remember that day. I was only 30 minutes away. I was in Shawnee, I was in college. And, um, but really hearing her talk about being 10 feet under that rubble, when she really, I mean, I'm just gonna say what she said, you're gonna hear it anyway, but she basically said to herself, I'm 28 years old and I haven't even decided to live. I haven't even decided to live. And you can hear more about that, like kind of the state of mind, the state of health she was in at the time. She's like, I've just, I'm, I've wasted these years and now I'm about to die. And this is, this is this all I'll have to show for it. And then the way that she, chose to transition to essentially transform her life from that point on is powerful wait till you hear her. wait until you hear her. she has this full circle moment um because she worked at the credit union which was in the Merle building on the third floor the the beautiful symmetry of that piece of her story i won't blow that one but it is like goosebumps goosebumps incredible so for any of you who are, you have experienced a trauma um, of any kind, be it emotional or physical, spiritual, mental, whatever. If you have experienced a trauma, something that you did not ask for, plan for, or expect, this is your episode. That what can, what can come from this even now, even now? even in the midst of such suffering, such loss. Um, I was so inspired by my conversation with Amy, so inspired by her. So don't forget that for all podcast episodes, you can of course just listen to them in your ears, but we have a, I have a YouTube channel um, over on YouTube where all of our, um, inter all of my interviews are recorded, video, video recorded. Hello, that makes sense, you understand YouTube. So if you wanna watch, any of the interviews. Sometimes it is so great to see faces and expressions um, to, to just watch somebody tell their story. I mean, I always get to do that because we are always looking at each other um, through the screen, but uh, you'll see such light in Amy's eyes if you want to go over to YouTube and watch our interview. Anyway, this one will inspire you. This will leave you feeling hopeful, like things are possible even when they are absolutely so devastating. Um, I really appreciated her. So you guys are going to love this conversation with really like the undefeatable um, Amy Downs. <laughs>